Buhari ruled Nigeria as a ghost. For six years without the consent of Nigerians. Hello, great viewers. Welcome to my noble channel. According to Bidin, he claimed that Buhari ruled Nigeria as a dead man for six years without Nigerians being aware of it. He claimed that it's only in Nigeria that a president ruled Nigeria as a dead man for six years without the masses of the country being away. Just like we continue to tell you from the beginning that Buhari was dead, long dead, buried in shallow grave in Saudi Arabia, but an impostor was sent by British government just to make sure that things continue to happen the way it is. In collaboration with some people, especially Sultan Sokoto and some other of them, Abbaslam, the former president of Nigeria, they planned with the British government to bring an impostor to rule you as a person. Why so many of us were saying it? Some people were doubting it. Even when CNN says that Buhari was long dead, I could remember when we provided the video and some of you still did not believe it. The same BBC said the same thing. Some of you did not believe it. Today they have contributed again. By providing an evidence from President Biden why he was at it saying that it was only in Nigeria that uh, President will rule the country as a dead man without the country being aware of it. I am going to allow you to watch the video soon. Just to wait for it a little time. Why we are saying this is because A man who was ruling Nigeria as Buhari was an impostor. And he planned with the Sultan of Sokota and so many other people from the north and some few people from the eastern part of the country and the Yoruba land to bring them the Kano back to Nigeria. Ruggedly tortured and kept in this as custody to death. I remember telling you in one of my news that Sultan of Sokoto and so many people from the north part of the country are the ones ruling this country, or Nigeria, through that thing in Asorok, who calls himself Buhari. Whereas he is not Buhari, he was not. He was an impostor sent by British government to keep Nigerians in bottom so that they will no longer rise up to speak. It's not open. And I believe some of you will not still believe. You may say sort of things to stop that or this and that. This is something he said. And people should understand this. The same Buhari today, after leaving office, he went to England and he was welcomed well, protected. This was a man who murdered so many people in Nigeria. He did a lot of atrocities, collaborated with flying terrorists to kill so many, collaborated with the soldiers to kill so many people in the eastern part of the country because he want Nigeria to continue to remain 
as one. That was the mission given to him by the federal government, by the people of the northern part of the country that call themselves leaders, by some APC members to make sure that he kept Nigeria as one. And for this reason, anybody can go down so far as he's coming from the eastern part of the country. So far as an Igbo man, he must go down. And this was part of the plans why Nam Kalo was kidnapped in the first instant. Because they were receiving too much heat from him. From the words coming from his mouth, they were so panicked. And for this reason, they have to plan for his kidnap and adoption, whatever it is, in collaboration with British government, whom in the first instant, created that thing and sent him to Asorok to continue as Buhari, whereas he was not Buhari. Here, we will tell you the things the way it is. When we will continue to say, and he refused to believe, we will stop. But time shall come when that same thing will sort of surface again, and we will tell you, was this not what we told you before? This is how we roll here in this channel. I will prefer you watch the video from the BBC and see how Bidi openly said it that Nigeria is the only country that was ruled for six years by a dead man as a president. That is it. And that dead man is nobody else but Buhari. He may not mention the name of the person, but you and I know that from the beginning to date of the creation of Nigeria, we know all of them that have ruled Nigeria, and none of them died while ruling Nigeria. Abacha died, and everybody was aware that he died. Yadua died, everybody was aware that he died. And another president was in star. It's only Buhari regime. No one else. He may not mention his name, but he was talking about him. I wanted to watch the video and at the same time share this news and remain blessed as you do. Cheers. Good evening and welcome to the BBC News at 6 from our new studio at Broadcasting House. A flight to Rwanda carrying just a handful of asylum seekers is due to leave the UK tonight after campaigners and charities failed in their bid to block it. The US president just made speech saying that Nigeria former president was a dead man ruling as a president. Listen to what he said. Nigeria is the only country where a dead man has been ruling as a president for six years without them knowing.